seeks to give the Department of Homeland Security the power to prohibit the entry of all migrants who do not have the necessary documentation to be in the U.S. if it deems it necessary to control the border with Mexico. In turn, it allows state prosecutors to file a lawsuit to force DHS to apply such a restriction if the federal government does not implement it. Americans elected a Republican majority to hold this administration to account for its constant failures on the southern border, said Congresswoman Ashley Hinson, who had already supported the bill at a press conference. The legislative proposal presented by legislator Ship Roy from the state of Texas already has the support of 58 congressmen from his party. However, several Republican congressmen have expressed their opposition to the bill, which has prevented it from being presented for a vote on the floor, the Washington Post reported this week. The main opponent of the bill is Congressman Tony Gonzalez of the state of Texas, who expressed uh, concern that if implemented, it would prevent people from applying for asylum at the border, U.S. media reported.